All right. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Terraria, where today we're going to be trying to beat the rest of the champions. And I'm going to see which one's left. Oh, we actually already beat all the champions. Whoops. Well, then, we're going to try to beat the daytime form of Empress of Light today. I just hope we can do it, because if not, I have no clue what I'm going to be doing next. Let's grab the summon, wherever it may be. Hmm. Floaty thing. Ooh. Ooh. I'm going to take this. I didn't even know that that was a thing there. Uh, I think I've got luck. Increases invincibility. I'm going to take that. Draconic Elixir. Ooh. I'm going to take that one too. Basically, I'm going all out because I have the <laughs> absolutely no way of actually winning this. And also, I'm going to be real with everyone. I'm very tempted to just grab the... What you call it? The... The Shimmering. Because it's one of those things that, like, it's super just not showing up for me. So I should just grab it from the menu. Because <laughs> that's, like, one of the few things that I'm actually missing, and it'd be such a annoying hunt. But... Where is... I need, like... Try and look for that like super sharpness potion. Cause I know that there was one up there, but it was not the right uh level. There you go, I wanted Luminite. Alright, there you go. Luminite sharp potion. Ooh, wait, traveling merchant. Before we start fighting that. Let's go over here and see what they have to sell. Where are they? There they are. Hi there, good sir. I'd like to inquire about your wares. Bedazzled Nectar. And that's about it. Okay then. I got so used to playing Normal Terraria recently. <laughs> Normal Terraria added this kind of auto research feature. So if I shift clicked, it would auto research. Alright, so. I guess now we just. Find the lace wing and uh, I guess set this thing into overdrive. Where is the lace wing? We have a town's bunny, town's cat. And here's where all these are. What? Lace wing. Here we go. And let's rock. Alright. Let's hope it's not too pissed at me for summoning it during the day. Whoa. Yeah, it's taking zero damage. I don't know why it's taking zero damage, but it is, and I can't tell where my mouse is. Alright, there it is. Yeah, it, it takes nothing. Why? Is it because I'm killing it too quickly, so I actually have to dodge something? Alright, I'm gonna try dodging from here for a little bit. Whoa, the architect, no! He's one of the better NPCs. Okay. Can't tell where my mouse is now. Alright, there it is. And now she's actually taking some damage. Ow. Yep, that was the... I think that was the revival. Yep, there's the revival. Alright. Need to get out of here quickly. Please just die. Alright, I think it's going into second phase. Yep. Means I have no time to attack. I just got to go. No, the tinkerer! Red Nautilus, excuse me. Alright, so, uh, yep. Thought that was gonna be the case. I need to figure out why it keeps just not taking damage. Is there just a thing for doing too much damage? Huh. Maybe. Hmm. 
eBay have too many effects going. Let me... Where's my piggy bank? There. Alright. Let's take off... Where did my Heart of the Elements go? Oh, there it is. Let's take off Heart of Elements. Let's take off... Hmm. Not quite sure what else. Maybe the Leech Scroll as well. Both those need to get re-equipped after. Alright. Let's try now and see what happens now that I've unequipped some things. Alright. So she's in. See, now she's taking damage. Even if it is a very, very little bit. Alright, let's get out of the way of those, not into those, thank you. Alright, go, 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 run! Alright, so basically I need to focus on running, and then shooting when I can. That's basically how things are going to work with this. Oh boy. That's difficult. Oh, sorry old man PCs. Alrighty. Keep moving, keep moving. Up, 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 go! Alright. Where is she? There. Up, 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 go, 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 up, go! Alright. <laughs> oh, that's gonna hurt. Come on, I know we can win this. Just dodge! Go, 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 go. Sorry, all my NPCs. Keep accidentally killing them. Right, go, 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 go. Oh, everyone's dying. My goodness. Whoa. All these lights are really hard to see. Alright, keep going, keep going, keep going. No! Alright, I just need to run. Go, 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 I need to win. Yes! Oh my god, okay. And that is the Terra Prisma unlocked. And I think that means that we've finally gotten the Forbidden One. Right, let me uh, go ahead and put all this back on. There's my piggy bank. I'm not even sure if the piggy bank kept up with me the entire time. <laughs> Oh, that was an adrenaline rush. Alright. So let's see. Forbidden. Yeah. So we've got the forbidden one. Forbidden one. Forbidden one. Forbidden one. And forbidden one. So this should activate every single research defect. Let's go ahead and... Uh, Turn this on and see just how crazy things get. Alright. And... Did it, uh, do it? Hello? Right leg, right arm, left leg, left arm, and this. Hmm. Forbid. Yeah, it's just those. Does it just not work? Did I do all of this for nothing? I don't think it works in this version. That just sucks. Or maybe I'm just doing it wrong. Well, somebody will hopefully let me know in the comments. But that's just in saddening that I've done all that and it's just like, nope. Well, maybe the Terra Prisma will evolve into something crazy with Calamity or something. Let me 
try to find it here. Got the Banshee Hook, Solstice Claymore, Park of the Elements, Dragon Pow. Okay. Galaxia. Enforcer. Oh. Pretty standard blade. Alright. Dragon's Rage. And Arc of the Cosmos. Okay, that does look pretty crazy, but... Alright. Back to the main task at hand. Adamantite Particle Accelerator. Hmm. Angelic Shotgun. Hmm. Oh. That's pretty cool. <laughs> I keep getting distracted by all these cool weapons. Anomaly's nano gun. I click to launch three fission bombs. Scorched earth. Fuel air rockets. Oh, that is. Uh, rocket. No. As far as chicken flares. Oh, we have a titanium rail gun. Is that better than the scientific one? Answer is no. Alright, so... Pulse Rifle. Huh. Lots of blood men. Let me just, uh, pause the time travel here. There's not really much special with the... with the blood moon now. So let's see, where did the Terra Prisma go? There. So, Terra Prisma. It is a material... for... Conjurer Soul, which we have now. Virid Vanguard. Seems a circular formation of blades. Does this evolve into something? No. But we have the Conjurous Soul now, which means that we're just a little bit away from this one, since you need the Abominable Energy. And that Berserker's Soul. Damn. What else do we need for the Berserker's Soul? Or is it just that stupid boomerang thing. Yeah, it's just the stupid boomerang. Okay. Uh, I can... No, for the sake of content, I'm just going to give myself the shroomerang. If I could actually reach my... Uh... There, okay. Well, apparently I'm not going to be able to do that because I can't reach my items. <laughs> my little taskbar is right above it. So, looks like we're just going to have to go and get that the old-fashioned way. I am curious about this. The Virid Vanguard. Doesn't deal more damage than that. So what's our best summon right now? The Lunar Moon Portal, the Chlorophyte Sniper, Midnight Sun Beacon, with 421 summon damage? My goodness. That's, that's the Stardust Whip. Whoops. Cadaverous Carrion. Summons a gross old dukehead. Hmm. Pole Warper. Yarn Kindle Staff, Endo Hydra. I'm curious to see what this is. Alright. I'll go ahead and uh, summon a few of these. Why not? So there are just little summons here. They deal way more damage than the Elemental Axe. Alrighty. I guess it's time to rock and roll with the. Uh, where put lava here? Huh. I actually can't remember why I put lava here. Alright, so. I guess before anybody else respawns, we should probably try to fight the abomination. Okay. Cool items. Where's my uh, 
summoner's soul. Hmm. Hyper runestone. Hmm. Here we go. Conjurous soul. Where is... My, there we go. Piggy bank. What don't I need? I'll probably need to replace some of these with the better potions. But, uh, probably don't need... Actually, I probably need all of these. <laughs> Just, um... Ba -ba -ba -ba. You know, I could live without... The Leech Scroll. Probably. Hmm. Affliction. That's damage reduction, so I don't feel like that's gonna be able to go. There's a lot of tough decisions. Uh, but, uh, I guess we'll just start replacing some of these first. So we need uh, the Luminite. Alright. So we need Endurance, Iron Skin, Heart Reach. I already got Sharp. Uh, Shine, Regen, Rage, Wrath. What else? We got Mining, could probably work. Swiftness, Thorns, and Summoning. Probably all the ones that we really need right now. So let's go ahead and swap these out. Swiftness. Get swapped there. Mining. Is where? Warrior. There is mining. Right. So there goes that one. Summoning. Where was summoning? There's endurance. Where did I put the endurance potion? Got wrath. Shine regen. Iron skin. Heart reach. Did I not pick it up? Oh no, there it is. Okay. So I'm gonna swap out those two bottles there. Iron skin was this one, right? Yeah. Rage. I did have rage. Let's get rid of that. Uh, summoning was this one. Yep, thorns. This one. Yes. And shine, we don't actually need it because we've got uh, sunshine. Regen went there. Nice. And lastly, there's rat. Actually, not lastly. That heart reach as well. So now we need to figure out where to slot this. You know what? Angler enchantment. As cool as it is, I, I don't really need it right now. So this is increases my max number of summons by a lot. So let's just uh, add a few more of these little guys here. Alright, so that should be uh, enough. Let's go on ahead and use this over here. Oh, the abomination isn't alive. Hold on, let me do that first. And then toss it in here. Alright. Lots of effects on screen. What effects are mine and what effects are his? I have no clue. Alright. So, I just need to... What is this? Oh, I forgot I had this. Not sure how much use that's doing right now, so let's just uh, focus on hitting him with everything we have. Which is not melee. Because we don't have all the damage drops for melee. Just gotta keep moving. Whoa! What is going on? He is taking some major damage from those summons, that's for sure. Maybe I should have gotten some summoner class stuff. 
Maybe you should have gotten a few of those calamity things that increase the summons potentials. Whoa. What if I had everything where like summons did an extra effect? Things could get pretty crazy here. Why am I taking so much damage? Why am I taking so much damage? Okay, yep. Starting to hurt a lot. Where is he? I can't even see him. There he is. Where is my summons? Right. Someone's over there absolutely grinding away at his HP. Whoa! Uh, get away, get away, get away, get away! What's he doing, what's he doing, what's he doing? Oh, I'm out of the ring. What is he doing? Oh no. Not my... Not my companions. Alright. Whoa. Oh no. Yeah, I probably should have... Not done this right now. Alright. Maybe I should leave the rest of the work to the minions. Okay, what is this? Defense? Oh. Toggles all... Okay. That's what screwed me over last time. It basically makes it so I... Yeah. All soul toggles are, toggle are disabled. So that gets rid of all of my soul abilities. So that's what happened. It gets rid of all of my super abilities at once. Ah. So I'm going to have to rely on effects that aren't from the souls. Okay. Hmm. Now that I know... Let's see what we can do. As Guardian Aegis... Is okay. So we need replacements for all of our souls. Probably from Calamity. Let's just be real. <laughs> Only Calamity is truly powerful enough to take this thing down. Hmm. What can I use? Since it gets rid of all the effects of basically everything I've worked hard for... Uh, Absorber. Deadshot Broche. That's for range, which is pretty good here. Uh... Sigil of Calamitous, that's for magic. Hmm. Tech sometimes fire a demonic eye. What does this evolve into? This evolves to eye scope. View range for guns. Demonic eye. Hmm. Let me find ranged additions. Since all of our souls become useless, we need everything we can get. Yerim's gift is definitely going to need to be part of the crew here. Where is... Where's my piggy bank? There he is. Alright. So how many souls do we have? We have Conjurous Soul. I'm going to remove here for a sec. Uh, soul the Master and Sniper's Soul. And the Soul of Terraria. Wow, without it, I feel almost powerless here. Oh, and it gets rid of our Flight Mastery Soul. That would explain why I had such a hard time maneuvering. Okay. So Yerm's Gift hasn't been equipped yet. Let's go on ahead and do that. As well as Deadshot Broche. Hmm. What else can I add? Because at this point, I just need sheer power. It's damage and melee speed. Rampart of the Deities. 
Hmm. Isn't there a like crazy crazy good thing from Calamity that has to do with ranged weapons? There's eye scope which I can use. The generator reduces max HP but greatly increases life regen, no thanks. Uh, hmm. Is there nothing here? If there's some sort of like thing that I'm missing, go ahead and let me know in the comments, cause uh, I I actually don't know how to get past this. Arcane armor breaker. Hmm. Skyward hilt. No. Mirage mirror. Nope. This could get very tricky. There's got to be something. Because the Sharpshooter Essence, I think, also gets taken out because that's part of the soul, the sniper's soul. Hmm. I'm definitely going to need something that keeps me in the air. Because right now, once that Soul of Flight Mastery gets turned off, I can only fly how far? Only fly that far. And then I get my extra jumps from Bundle of Balloons. Hmm. I have no clue. Increased damage as health decreases. I don't know, an extra 20% damage could just be the key. Void of Calamity. Brimstone Fireballs rain down after getting hit. This evolves to what? Void of Extinction. Which I would not turn down at this point. Void of Extinction would be done here because... No, these aren't in order. Never mind. There's Void of Extinction. We've got Dread Shell. Huh. Angel Treads. And that, that was about the time when it's like the culmination of everything because we can't use our strongest stuff. I'm probably going to give it maybe one last attempt during today's episode. Actually, I'll probably set up after today's episode and then try to get this all good ooh the text trick bullseye will automatically crit and deal massive damage if I struck it vanishes and no one appears elsewhere large projectiles cannot strike bullseyes more readings crit strike chance extra critical strike damage alright that that looks pretty good. Uh, amalgamation. No, the amalgam. It's ability to dodge. Dodge is 90 second cooldown. Uh, variety of debuffs when hit. I'll take that. Where's the Void of Calamity, though? So melee speed. Max minions and reduced mana costs. I'll take that. Max Minions is going to be crucial at this point. Right, so where was... So we've got Asgardian Aegis, which I think I already equipped, didn't I? I don't know, but I'm going to equip this guy here. So how many... We're working with one, two, three, four, five. No, four open slots that we need to fill. We've got three there. Where is that Void of Extinction? Actually... Is this... No, that increases wing flight time. And that's used to craft that, okay. So that sucks, but... Let's see what else we got. Okay, I'm just gonna look it up now. Void... Of extinction. Here we go. That's an extra 10% increase to damage. 
So, it's gonna. Oh, okay. That's plus ten percent damage for ranged attacks. This is max minions, and this is increased damage. It's fifteen percent increased damage. I'd rather that. And so this does increase range damage. So what's my damage looking at? Okay. So. Oh, who the heck is this person? Hi there. And why are you here? This is from... This is from Calamity. Wow, that feels weak. Okay, that's... Deals 45,000. Yeah, I think I'm gonna have to try to make something off camera, because this is... Now that I know that is actually quite terrible, because I I don't know what to do from here. <laughs> Alright. So, while I'm busy having an existential crisis, I'm going to go ahead and send you all off with, I hope you all enjoyed watching, and I will be seeing you all in the next one. Bye, everybody!